Hey guys, today we have a new video for Final Fantasy XV. This is an easy leveling method which can be used pretty early in the game. You can easily overlevel and head to 40s even if you are not past chapter 3. There are no entry requirements, you don't have to get to a specific chapter in order to start doing this. So basically, you can start doing this as soon as you gain control of Noctis in the star. You will need to find a couple of items first which are accessible from the beginning of the game. If you have started playing the game, I'm sure you already have some of these items laying around in your inventory. So let's get started. After absorbing some element from campsites, head over to the elements menu and empty a flask. Combine whatever spells you want then head over to the treasure tab. There are coins under the treasure tab called rare coins, debased coins and silver coins. If you use these coins in your elemental spell mixture, they give a buff called experience bonus. This experience bonus can be stacked up to level 99 if you have enough coins. You can't mix different types of coins together, so you'll want to have more of the same type of coin. For example, 10 silver coins or let's say 10 debased coins in order to achieve a higher experience bonus level. After you create spell, equip it and head into a battle. I recommend you do this against Imperial soldiers as they start the fight club together and are very easy to take out with a single spell. Depending on what experience bonus level you were able to get with your spell mixture, the amount of experience you get will vary from my fight. For example, you might be able to get 30,000 experience in one fight. To make this more effective, eat some food with fresh buff in order to increase the experience you gain from each fight. Once you're done using all your coins and all your spells, you have to make a decision in which end you will rest. If you're in chapter 9 or later, you have access to an end which has a 3 times experience multiplier at the cost of 30,000 gil. If you're still in chapter 2, you have access to an end which has a 2 times multiplier at the cost of 10,000 gil. If you're still in chapter 1 or at any chapter and broke as hell like me, you can rest in a 1.5 experience multiplier end at the cost of 300 gil. Keep in mind that if you head over to the ascension menu, under the magic tab, there are a couple of skills you can learn to get a better return on each spell you make. You have to make a decision if these two additional charges are worth the return you'll be making on this investment. Also, please keep in mind that the levels are not the only source for gaining AB. If you're only out to gain AB, AB can be obtained via multiple methods and levels are not the easiest way. I might cover AP in a future video if there's enough demand on it. Drop me a comment if you have any questions, leave a like if you learned something new and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for watching, goodbye.